Well, as first responders continue to treat people for these heat related illnesses in the heat of the summer, local doctors want you to keep an eye on the important people people in your life, especially senior citizens. Yeah, and they say older people are much more likely to suffer from heat related illnesses when compared to younger people. Fernando joins us again in the newsroom with more from what these doctors say to have a safe and healthy summer. Good morning. Hey, Abby, Raya, good morning. Some seniors may have chronic medical conditions that can change the body's normal response to heat. Others, you know, blood flow to the skin reduces the older you get. But regardless of the reason, health experts say seniors are more likely to experience heat related illnesses, especially during the summer. So seniors and people caring for their seniors, there are some things doctors say you should be doing if you're going to be outside this summer. Number one, consider wearing a hat and light colored loose clothing. Also shorten the amount of time you spend outside. If you like spending time outside, consider going on shorter walks or enjoying seated shaded areas. And number three, remember to drink water even if you're not feeling thirsty. The doctor I spoke to says it really doesn't take long for people to feel sick if they're outside when it's super hot. It can happen quickly. Don't have to be outside very long, particularly if you have any medical conditions or or even on medications that can impair your ability to respond to heat. People may experience signs of heat related illness sooner than they they realize. For those of you watching with seniors in your life, Dr. Gillespie says it's important to check on them regu regularly. Make sure they have access to air conditioning or a cool place to rest. And again, make sure they're drinking tons and tons of water. Dr. Gillespie says some of our elders also take fluid pills, which can cause more dehydration. And of course, if you think your loved one may be experiencing something like a stroke, for example, don't wait and get medical attention as soon as you can. Back to you. All right, Fernando, thanks so much. These are important reminders. It is dangerously hot. We talk about that. Absolutely.